What's up, everybody? Welcome to this week's technical run through. This is for Sunday, February the 16th, week three of our series. I'm fine, not really. Um, we have a guest pastor this week. Pastor Irene Rollins is going to be with us in the house. And so let's go ahead and talk through order of service. Five minute countdown will be a local fire, as always. And then we're going to be into zeal, followed by your great name and then Jesus, you alone, and then at the end of Jesus, you alone, there's going to be like a worship flow tag, and they're going to do two more courses of that, and then after that, your (laughs) campus pastor or local host will be up to do your local ministry time, and you're welcome. At that point, at the end of that, and this week, instead of the normal three, they have five minutes for that uh, welcome and local ministry time. After that, they will throw to news. News is when we will go point to point. We'll have news, and then Pastor Irene, at the end of the news, which we don't have because it's not shot yet, but they'll be doing, uh, Pastor will be doing a roll-in intro for Pastor Irene, and then she'll be bringing the message. At the end of the message, your campus pastor or local host will close out. If you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us. Otherwise, let's go ahead and dive into the five minute. Let's go. 
instrumental build. Chorus, all in. It on the four here. One, two, one, two, three, four. on the four here and it's a big celebrate biggest celebrate of your life intro two three four five six intro verse one
the one Pastors or local hosts will take the stage into a worship moment. There's a lyric that says, you broke the curse for our freedom. I want you to know that Jesus died for our freedom so that we would not have to be in bondage to anything. That's fear, worry, anxiety, depression, etc. And this song reminds us of that truth. But I know that there's some of you in this room that feel as if you're bound in a certain area of your life. And I'd like to pray for you that you would receive the truth and freedom today. And then at this point, pray. Jesus, we love you. And we're so thankful, God. 2,000 years ago, you hung on a cross to break the curse, to break what bonded us. And Lord, we're thankful for you. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Come on, church. That will be a celebrate today. There. Who's glad they came to church today? Awesome. Probably more. So good worshiping with you. You can go ahead and take your seats. If I've had not if I've not had the honor and privilege of meeting you, my name is Foodie, and I get the privilege of serving as our chief cook and bottle washer. I want to welcome each of you to church today, and I want to give a special welcome to anyone that may be here for the first time. Can you help me welcome them, church? We are so glad that you decided to join us today, and we hope that you have already had a great experience so far. But our ultimate prayer would be that you leave here today knowing God better than you did when you came through our doors. Here's what you can expect for the rest of the day. In just a moment, we're going to check out our church news where you'll learn everything that's going on in the life of LifePoint. And then we'll link up with our broadcast location to hear a life-giving message that will challenge and change you. We're in the middle of our current series called, I'm Fine, Not Really. And I know that it's impacted me. Share how it's impacted you. One more thing I'd like to share with you is a story about, and then at this point you would give a growth track story. Tell them that step one is happening today and where they can find it. And then close out. Isn't that awesome? Awesome. Why don't you go ahead and turn your attention to the screens for church news which is still being filmed, so we'll add that in post. And I finished with two minutes and 30 seconds on the clock. Just as a reminder, this week, campus pastors and local there. hosts, you have five minutes, not the normal three, so just be ready for that. So uh, go ahead and, at this point, throw to church news. At this point, Pastor Irene Rollins will be here bringing the message. And so if you have any questions about today's flow, please feel free to reach out to us. Otherwise, have a great Sunday, and we'll see you next week. Foodie out.